Stem Cell is a powerful set of tools designed for cleaning up surround stems prior to recording or monitoring. It supports channel widths from mono to 916. It's intended as the final stage in a signal path, giving you the ability to clean up unwanted top or bottom end, catch any overs, duck around dialogue frequencies, base manage signal to and from the LFE, and massage the signal before or after down mixing with spanner. Each channel has completely independent control parameters. Stem Cell uses a single set of multi-purpose controls, which update depending on which channels you have selected. When a single channel is selected, you'll see the controls colored to match the channel in focus. When multiple channels are selected, you'll see the controls switch to colors reflecting their roles. You can make a selection using the colored buttons or by clicking on the channel views. The usual list selection key modifiers work as well. There are also a set of predefined selection buttons for commonly used groups like all minus LFE or all surrounds. If all the selected channels have the same value for a given parameter, the relevant control will display that value. If the selected channels have different values, you'll see a default value displayed, or in the case of a checkbox, an intermediate state. The HPF and LPF controls set the frequency and slope of these filters. You can command click on the filter handle to switch slope. Note that when redirect mode is engaged, the slope controls are disabled as a fixed 24 decibels slope is enforced. The peak limiter in stem cell is intended as a safety feature, offering transparent, uncolored, digital, true peak limiting with a minimum of latency. The limiter uses carefully chosen fixed parameters and is designed to be as fast as possible without allowing distortion on moderately low frequencies. The limiter on the LFE is set up differently to better control the extremely low frequencies found there. The limiters on each channel are completely unlinked, so a large transient on the left channel will not cause a dip on the right or center. The spectral duck is a unique processor which allows the gentle ducking of frequencies which might mask or clash with some other more important signal. Goodbye, Bruno. While extreme creative effects can be achieved, spectral duck Goodbye. is most useful when applied in small doses. Goodbye, Bruno. Imperceptibly making space in your mix without fundamentally changing Goodbye, it. Bruno. The best use case is to duck the FX and music stems around the dialogue. We would insert stem cell on our music stem master or aux track. Then the dialogue signal would be sent to a bus, which we choose as the sidechain in our music stem cell. Sense controls the sensitivity of the processor, effectively magnifying the depth of cuts. Goodbye, Bruno. Depth controls the maximum cut that may be applied to any one frequency. Sit down, boy. Goodbye, Bruno. The dashed orange line indicates the enabled status and sensitivity value for this channel. For spectral duck, we also have a set of global controls which apply to all channels. Goodbye, Bruno. The attack and release globally affect the response time of the spectral ducker. Sit down, boy. Goodbye, Bruno. If you're finding the ducking is too obvious, try playing with these parameters. Sit down, boy. Goodbye, Bruno. The high pass and low pass down, determine the range Goodbye. of frequencies in which the ducker will operate. Redirect mode takes the low frequency signal removed from a channel and sends it to the LFE. Conversely, the high frequency signal from the LFE can be redirected into the left and right channels. The purpose is primarily to create a powerful base management system for monitoring purposes. But it can also be applied in other situations such as down mixing or 
IMAX reformatting. The redirect filters use a fixed slope 24 dB link width Riley design of the kind commonly used in speaker crossovers. So when redirect is engaged for a channel, the slope parameter is ignored and disabled in the user interface. Given the unpredictability of low frequencies, it may be that you need some control over the level of this redirected signal. Stem cell offers two additional automatable stages of gain, one on each channel and a master gain stage. 